Okay, this is called a buttercup squash. It's flat on this side, as you can see, and it's more rounded on this side. This is a buttercup squash. Uh, it's dark green. This is ripe with light green stripes. Um, for comparison, this is my butcher knife. So it's pretty good sized. Okay. This is about the size you want it to be when you pick it. Now I'm going to cut it in half. So I'm going to cut it across this way. So when it's cut, so it's pretty rolly. When when it's cut, I'll cut it just directly this direction. Okay, I cut it in half that way. So it's like this. Cut it in half. And now you have it's open, so you can see the seeds. Okay. So now we have the two halves. I'm going to go ahead and scoop the seeds out so that I can use them and clean them well, dry them out so that I can use them again next season. Okay, so I have scooped all the seeds out, as you can see. This one is much more hollow. This side is much more hollow. So I scooped all the seeds out of there. And I've also scooped the seeds out of this one. And this is these are the seeds. So I will clean them and, um, and wash them. And I will remove all of the orange from the seeds. And then I will dry the seeds out and so I'll have them for next season. So I can replant them again in the spring, and I'll have these wonderful squash. Um, there are several ways to prepare them. Um, I am going to, tonight, I'm just going to um, put them in a microwavable dish and microwave them to cook them. And I'll show you how to do that. So you just need a microwavable dish of some sort. I'm going to use this um, dish that was given to me by um, by a family member, uh, Jed, family member. Let's see if you can see that. Um, let's see, the name is right there, Jed. Jed, family member. He made this for me, and I was able to get it at an auction, family auction that we do um, each summer. And so I'm just gonna turn this upside down on here. And if, if it doesn't quite fit, then you can just slice it and I'll show you that. Okay, so I have sliced up my buttercup squash and made it fit into my microwavable um, container. And I put it, I've laid it down this way so that the green is towards me so that um, the moisture is inside. The moisture will stay inside there better that way. And it won't splatter in your microwave. Okay. So now I'm just going to microwave it for about, I'm going to try, I'm going to start with um, 15 minutes and see how that goes. So while my squash is in the microwave um, cooking, I am going to remove the orange from the seeds. And the orange I'll just throw away and the seeds I will keep so that I can use them again next season. 